What's up guys, welcome back to the channel and if you're new around here, welcome to the channel and welcome to day two of our seven day challenge. Hey everyone, I am so happy you're here. We are on day two and we've got two really, really amazing techniques to share with you. Here we are, studio number one, also known as my lounge. Uh, tomorrow, who knows, we might choose a, a more exotic location, go up to my kitchen, who knows, right? right? This is where all the action is happening. So, um, like yesterday, uh, order number one, we're going to start with TLC for our eyes. And the second technique, we're going to focus on our feet. And um, this, uh, this technique that I'm going to share with you, it's a combination of acupressure, energy medicine, and also how to use the power of our mind to overcome stress. So, um, so stay tuned. And also, yeah. before we start, please write how you're feeling now and after, yeah. when, after the, the... Yeah, yeah, after that's a finished. really good And point. also, say how you feel about it in the comment section. We love to know your feedback. Yeah, there is a reason that um, he yeah. is my social media ex Yeah, so he's right. So rate yourself on a scale of 1 to 10. 1 being that you're feeling on top of the world and you're feeling unsinkable and invincible. And number 10 being that you're feeling a little bit overwhelmed and um, you're feeling stressed or anxious uh, a lot is number 10. So go ahead and rate yourself. The first number that comes to your mind is, a, is the right one for you. So don't overthink it. And we'll come back to this a bit later. Okay, so let's get started with technique number one for today. Is our eyes. Like, how are you feeling? What number are you feeling? Uh, I, I'm about, I think I'm, I'm about a five or a oh, four. Same, yeah. Oh, you, you as well. I'm sort of four and a half. Yeah, good point. So let's focus on our eyes. Let's start by rubbing our eyes and then we're going to just use these hands. little rubbing our hands. eyes. Yeah. yeah, rubbing our hands. There's a reason I brought you on, Ronit. Um, so rubbing our hands and then just using our fingers like feathers to just gently go over our eyes, just really gently. Okay, let's start. Let's start rubbing, 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 rubbing. rubbing. <laughs> Sorry. Let's start rubbing. Rub your hands. And also, before we, we start this, if you do have glasses, please do take them off. You see, I always take them off. Rub and then gently go over your eyes like feathers. That's one. Let's do this about five times. And while you're doing this, just focus on your breathing. You don't need to change your breathing. Just focus on it. And gently, we're on number three, I think. And number four. And five. We're just feeling away all the tiredness from the eyes. Okay? Now, take your hands and gently place them on your eyes. Okay, and let's focus on our breathing. So I want you to breathe in slowly up to a count of five and I'll count you up. And then breathe out for a count of six. Okay, and we'll do this three times. So slowly, so slow and steady. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. And breathe out. Six, five, four, three, two, one. That's a bit tricky, speaking, counting and breathing in. Right, let's give it another go. Let's try and fill your lungs, fill your tummy in with air as we breathe in, okay? Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. And breathe out. Six, five, four, three. Two, one. And the last one, let's make it count, make it count. One, two, three, four, five. And breathe out. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Slowly bring your hands down, come back into the room. Can you tell the difference? Yeah. Yeah. 
you can't see them have you been pro so the trick is not to put any pressure on your eyes but to just gently cup them my eyes feel really so do mine. relaxed yeah like my, my put a bit more fuzzy is it ah. okay so now on to technique number two which is to do with our feet um i'd recommend if you're wearing something um like you know tight jeans or something um restrictive then go on and slip into your pajamas or something that's a bit more stretchy so that gives you a bit more movement and um and we'll get started i need to adjust the camera so yeah you can oh actually before i go you can do this technique on the floor or sitting on a chair and we'll show you you know both the ways and i'll see you in a bit hey everyone welcome back i'm more comfortable doing it on the floor so that's what i'm going to do but uh, ronit will show you how you can do it on the chair so first things first you don't really have to sit in a lotus position make it your own if this is more comfortable for you you can do that and access your feet okay so what we're going to do with our feet is start to focus on our feet and our you know how our hands feel and the pressure that we feel we're going to use our body's um, energy our body's electromagnetic field as it's also called to bring our energy back down so we feel grounded and we feel like we can get a lot more done and the head feels a lot calmer okay so first things first we are going to trace with a little bit of pressure just a tiny bit using our finger our index finger and our thumb the space between our bones on the toes i hope you can see my feet so i'm just going to use my thumb and my index finger and just gently apply pressure from the arch and on the top of my foot and trace the space between the bones and i'm just going to feel it off almost imagine like you're feeling off fear that you're letting go of stress as you do this okay and then we'll move on to the next toe and then just apply a teeny bit of pressure and then take it all the way to between your toes and just feel it off just let it go and then the third one mummy how many times do you do on the toe yeah good question just just once per per space and with this one i'm going to use my other hand and just feel it off okay yeah that's it and then we are going to turn the foot around the same foot and it doesn't matter which one you started with we'll do both of them just put your a bit of pressure and i'm going to use my thumbs you use what's comfortable for you a, pre a bit of pressure on the ball of your feet just in the middle just there and the other fingers on the top so we're just going to press it a little bit and while we're doing that with the other hand i just want us to massage our feet you know just give it a bit of pressure so our our heel takes a lot of pressure you know when we're standing and and so it's really nice to give it some tlc so just apply a bit of pressure with all your fingers or with your thumb you know just rub it down this feels the best for me so that's what i'm going to do so apply pressure on your heel while you're still holding on to that pressure point at the ball of your feet okay and feel into it and i just love closing my eyes and just feeling the pressure i'm just really enjoying this okay and yeah gently open your eyes if you've closed your eyes that feels really nice it just kind of yeah. relaxes you it especially is. when you close your eyes it just feels it? really nice good good that's, that's what it's nice. meant to be that's so what it's relaxed. meant to be it's, like, it's kind of funny how it's on your feet and like you feel relaxed that's right it's like it's kind of it's it's funny yeah. how it's on your feet but it's a mind that gets yeah. relaxed because it's all connected so now if you're sitting on the chair i want you to focus on what ron is doing take it away ron it ready right so let's swap our foot so whichever foot you did before to the other one now and we're going to do the same thing we're going to trace the space between our toes okay so i hope you can see us clearly you can see ron it's feet as well brilliant 
Okay. So basically, just get your fingers like a crab claw, and just put them on the space between the bone, and just like pull right to the end of the toe, just like that. Yeah, and the space, that. yeah, we pull yeah. right to the yeah, to yeah. the space between the toes. Okay. And do that twice, okay. and then move we'll on yes. to the next toe. Yeah, move we'll on to the next toe and pull out. And let's say we are letting go of like not being able to see your friends for like yeah. so long yeah. and just like being really upset, like being really worried. It's like a hold it. Yeah. Make That's sure that good. you're in a happy mood now. So yes. Just, like, like of all the sadness, everything. Yeah. But then, and then we do it once for between each toe. Yeah. And then if and you have then, trouble getting to the last toe, you can just put your foot up and just yeah. do it with the other hand. It yeah. Really make a difference. Yeah. It's a really forgiving technique. So, you know, don't worry about getting it wrong. So once you've done all the toes, then what do we do, run it? It's time for the massage. Yeah. So then you just grab your hand, another like a claw. Put it right in, in between the ball of your feet. Yeah. And you can take your other another claw and just start massaging it. Just like yeah. close your eyes if you want to. It makes a big difference on doing that. Yeah. And you just just relax. Don't just be tense. Just really just let go of of, it, of everything. Yes. And just focus on your heels and just press. Press down and enjoy this massage. And it doesn't matter how long you do it for, just give it a go and um, a couple of minutes should be fine, won't yeah. it? Yeah, a couple of minutes Probably even like, a minute, yeah, yeah, you will feel like a difference. One, it doesn't really matter how long you do it, it will make a difference anyway. Mm. Like, it will. But do it for at least a minute yeah. so to, to really find the difference. Obviously the longer you do it, the better it is. Yeah. And now slowly come back into the room. Let's put our feet down. And so that that's is day, day number, number two, two complete. How do you feel? Um, I'd like you to again rate your mood, rate how you're feeling emotionally, mentally, on a scale of one to ten. Again, one being that you feel amazing on top of the world, and ten being you feel a bit overwhelmed. Go with the first number that comes to your mind. And, um, and and compare it then to what you felt at the beginning. Um, so I am, I'm sort of on a two, two and a half. So, so I moved, are you the same? Uh, where, I think I'm actually on a one. I think you're a one. Sure. Yeah. So it's moved for me. I, you know, do let us know if it moved for you and, um, and that that's it from us. Oh yes, in, in the comments below, we would love to hear from you. And, um, and yeah, is there anything? Yes, before you go, a little message that I'd like to say. Share these videos with everyone you know so they know about these amazing techniques. And also, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, you are making a very big mistake. So please do that and also turn on the notification bell. You'll be notified whenever we post. Thank you and good night. Stay safe. Bye.